Hi, I'm Dan Martell, serial entrepreneur, investor, and creator of SaaS Academy. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you how to create a referral page system to get your current customers sending you new customers without overthinking it. And be sure to stay to the end where I'll tell you how to get my exclusive referral page blueprint to get you going as fast as possible. You probably realize this, but one of the easiest ways to get high quality, excited customers for your product is to ask your current users to share it with a friend. You've seen this with the Dropbox. Everybody knows their story, but they went from a thousand, a couple thousand users to millions of users by ensuring they've incentivized their customers at the right time to share their product with a friend. I've been doing it in every one of my companies, most recently with Clarity.fm, before that, Flowtown, and it's something that I coach all of my clients to implement in their product day one. Step one, choose a win. If you've ever had anybody, and this could be like a gym or a local business or even a software product you were visiting their website, ask you to share that product with a friend before you've even used it, then you realize that that strategy does not work. The reason why is you need to figure out what is the moment within your customer's user experience or journey that gets them a win and prompt them at that moment because it's on that high when they've just gotten the result that you've promised that they're most eager and likely to share that product with somebody that they know would be an ideal customer for them. So you need to choose a win and insert the ask or the referral at that moment. Step two, give to both. The super specific strategy that you need to implement when you're building a referral system is not only to reward the giver, the customer you're asking to share it with, but you need to give them something that rewards the receiver, the new customer, because you need to create the mindset that there's an exclusive opportunity that their friend or colleague will only get if they take action today. Meaning that if they go to the homepage and they sign up for the product, they're gonna get a set uh, list of features, but if they use the link that that person referred, they get an enhanced version of the product. This could be more space, as, as Dropbox does. This could be a longer trial, as many B2B software tools do. This could be any other little perk or tweak to the features that allows them to get a benefit only received when that individual shares their referral link. That is key, both need to win. Step number three, make it easy. Most people do something simple as providing a link, a referral link that if uh, your customer shares, it gets tagged to their account so they receive the credit for that new customer sign up. But you need to take it to another level. You need to make it so simple that within the interface, they don't have to leave to share. Maybe it's as simple as clicking some checkbox and sharing on their Facebook, Twitter, or other social networks or even more so going the next level deeper and don't even make them think about the copy that they should share in the tweet. And better yet, and this is the ultimate, if you provide the opportunity for your customers to use email, write the email for them. For you to think that your customer is gonna be able to explain your product or define the benefits and the features in a way that's gonna entice the receiver to click that link, register and try out your product, um, you're dreaming. Work with the copywriter, write the email, make everything uh, executable in one spot and really make it easy for your customer. Step number four, seed it. You know, one of my favorite things to do uh, when I design product is to hint towards um, the next step in the interface. And that could be as simple as having uh, an invite a friend uh, box in the top right corner of your product. It could be uh, a modal window, a pop-up that shows up at one point and say, you know, at some point we might ask you to do one of these three things. It could be even a link in an email, but whatever you do, you need to seed your referral system so that customers know that it's coming and they can expect it. And some people are gonna be so excited, especially if you offer, you know, extended trials or discounted pricing for inviting new friends, or you might actually pay them with real dollars, um, you need to make sure that you bring that awareness to them. So many times I see products that have a referral system, but it's buried in the product and customers using it never get exposed to it. They don't see it via email, prompt in the interface, or in the navigation. If you wanna get people to use that and refer other customers, you need to see it inside the product. 
So quick recap, number one, choose a winning moment. Number two, give to both parties. Number three, make it easy, write the copy. Number four, seed it in the interface so they are aware that there is a way for them to be rewarded. As I mentioned, I wanna share with you an exclusive download, my referral page blueprint. You can click the link below in the description to download the wireframe and the specific features that you need to build a referral system that's not complicated and doesn't get you to overbuild that process. Uh, if you like this video, be sure to click the like button below, hit subscribe, and share it with a friend. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. I don't understand, Jared. I wasn't doing the story before. I would just get into it. Are you saying I should do it? At the end of the last round. Okay. So we weren't doing it. Mm -hmm. but it